Hey, this is Steve from Legit Tech Tutorials, and welcome back to my uh, tutorial series channel. Uh, so, we are doing a new series today. Well, technically, this is probably going to be the middle of the series, so don't be alarmed if you see this in the middle of the series, because I am in a class at my, San Jose, uh, at my university, San Jose State, in San Jose, California, in the Mechanical Engineering uh, Department. There is a technical elective I have to take two to uh, complete my bachelor degree in mechanical engineering at San Jose State. And one of the technical electives I'm taking is uh, CAD, and um, the uh, advanced CAD, I guess you'd call it. And so this CAD course is uh, beginning, intermediate, and expert uh, concepts using SOLIDWORKS. So for my channel, you know that I am mainly used to uh, messing around with uh, uh, Fusion 360. I generally design with Fusion 360 and before that I used uh, Inventor and uh, most of uh, most people in the work environment and sometimes even in the hobbyist environment actually use uh, Fusion, um, use SolidWorks. So um, I'm going to so I thought that it was cool to uh, put this on and pl uh, put this on my Legit Tech Tutorials channel because a lot of people would be looking for tutorial for uh, videos like this, um, trying to learn uh, SolidWorks. So I thought that because I'm going to do it anyways, might as well include it so that uh, I could take you guys on the the, uh, the ride with me through here, especially when this is a 16 week uh, course. And we're actually in work week six of school already. So what I'll do is at the end, this there's also going to be at the very end there's going to be a certificate, um, where you take the certificate to be certified in SolidWorks, and uh, that basically if you get that you get a hundred percent on your final. If you take that test, which the teacher is going to provide, and you go to that test and you pass that test. You uh, become certified in, in uh, SolidWorks, and also you um, get 100% on your final, so you don't have to take the final. So basically, this is all the road to uh, the road to that, and also the road to the final. So uh, what I'll be doing is to practice. I'll go back to weeks one, two, three, four, and uh, five and do those as well and add those uh, at the beginning. So basically what will happen is that this, uh, the order is going to, the order of the videos is going to be out of order. But uh, I will um, arrange it inside of the playlist of uh, learning SOLIDWORKS so that you get week one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And four, five, six, and then continuing seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and sixteen. So again, these are beginning, inter beginning, intermediate, uh, advanced, and advanced topics of SolidWorks. So we're going to go into start from the basics, creating sketches, then uh, creating 3D models. Then we do, uh, and this is up to we've already, so I've already obviously done this. I'm on week six now. So you do sketches, 3D model, and then you do um, after you do 3D model. Then you're going to do drawings, then you do assemblies, and then you do um, uh, revolves, and then you do um, other other of the uh, different um, tools. So, for example, revolve and um, stuff like loft and sweep and stuff like that. 